kids podcast. <laughs> you can go slow. A kids podcast about. Hello, my name is Tess, and I am so happy to be here with you at the very end of our day to say goodnight. It is just such a good time to think back on what happened today, on how we felt throughout the day, and just wind down together. Are you ready? Me too. I love knowing all day long that I get to see you and hear about how your day was and how you're feeling. So first of all, I just want to say thank you so much for being here with me. I'm just always so happy as I go through my day that I get to spend some time with you before bed. So I want to say thank you for being here. It's really, really, really good to see you. So as you know, what we always do is make sure that you are already in your jammies. Make sure you have already brushed your teeth and said goodnight to people and told them that you love them. And this time, I want you to crawl right into bed. But I'm going to tell you right now, we are not going to close our eyes. So put your head on the pillow, that nice soft pillow. Good. Pull up the covers but we're not closing our eyes. Okay. Okay. So now I want you to look at your ceiling in your room, find a spot in your room and just stare at it at your ceiling and don't close your eyes. Do not blink your eyes. Okay. Just keep staring at that spot on the ceiling and don't close your eyes. I know you're going to want to close your eyes, but keep them wide open. No blinking either. Oh my goodness. Notice how when you keep your eyes open on purpose, your body starts telling you things like, hey, wait a minute, it's time for sleeping. So as you keep your eyes open and stare at your ceiling, are you noticing that you're starting to feel really sleepy? And maybe your body is starting to yawn. This is a trick that we can use when we don't feel sleepy. And we know that we need to sleep. So you're going to keep your eyes open, keep them open for as long as you can. But your body is saying, hey, we're tired. Let's go to bed. Close your eyes. So when you hear your body say, we're tired, let's go to bed. Close your eyes. I want you to listen to it. And just let your eyes close. And maybe have a big yawn if you have any. And if your body didn't say that, you can keep your eyes open and keep staring at that spot and try not to blink until your body just says, okay, let's go to sleep now. And you just can't keep them open anymore. And that's when you know that it's time for sleep. So right now, can you close your eyes? Feel that nice soft pillow. Feel that nice soft bed. Feel those nice soft covers. Take a big deep breath in. Let it out. One more big deep breath in. Let it out. And just feel yourself sinking deeper into your bed, into your sleep. Thank you to you for being here with me. I can't wait to see you tomorrow morning. Have an amazing sleep with lots of happy dreams. And remember, there is nobody in the whole world with a heart just like yours. I love you. And I love your big heart so much. Good Morning, Good Night is written by me. Tess Levitt. You can learn more about me and my work by visiting bigheartjourney.com. You can write to me or record a voicemail and send it to listen at akidsco.com. 
I would love so much to hear about your day, and I would love to hear the ways that you say goodnight. Our show is edited and produced by Matthew Winner, with the help from Chad Michael Snavely and the team at Sound On Studios. Our executive producer is Jelani Memory. And this show was brought to you by a kids podcast about. Follow the show on Apple Podcasts or wherever podcasts are found and check out other podcasts made for amazing kids just like you by visiting akidsco.com. <laughs>